watch tonight, a Salinas doctor who had his office and home raided yesterday was in a Salinas courtroom today. And as it turns out, his troubles go beyond his medical practice. Action News reporter Felix Cortez is live in Salinas with details. Well, Aaron, it's the case of Stephen Mangar, whose medical practice is currently under investigation. But today, he was in a Salinas courtroom charged with driving under the influence of meth. This is a mugshot of Dr. Stephen Mangar after he was arrested Valentine's Day last year on charges he was driving under the influence of methamphetamine. In court Friday, the 44 year old doctor did not enter a plea and was ordered back next month. I don't know what's going on. The court appearance came just a day after the doctor's West Alisal practice, Pacific Pain Care, and North Salinas home were searched by health officials, along with state and local agents who investigate health care fraud. I don't know what's going on, but uh, he doesn't seem like the guy that would, you know, would get mixed up with something like this or have. Police coming. Friday afternoon, pain care was open for business, but Dr. Mangar referred all questions to his attorney, who said, We're trying to get information ourselves as to what prompted it. The raid, that is. But a search of Mangar's medical license may provide a clue. It was revoked in 2012, but the medical board stayed the order after Mangar agreed to three years probation. According to these court documents, the action stems from accusations. The pain doctor was furnishing drugs without examinations and billing patients for exams not done. And then, less than three months ago, the medical board moved to revoke that probation and possibly Mangar's license based on similar allegations. Thursday's raids may somehow be connected. Well, there's a number of things that are under investigation. I'm not really at liberty to talk about the specifics, uh, but there's a, a number of issues that uh, we're looking into. It's really early in the, in the, in the process right now. Uh, they're still collecting uh, uh, evidence and they'll be conducting uh, interviews. Now, to be clear, so far no arrests or charges have been made in connection to the uh, investigation surrounding Mangar's medical practice. But regarding those DUI charges that have been filed against him, Mangar will answer to those March 5th when he's back in the Salinas courtroom. Reporting from Salinas, I'm Felix Cortez, KSBW, Action News 8.